What is going on, Gulf Coast Nation? Guys, welcome to another bonus episode. Like we've said before, we're gonna keep trying to bring you guys some bonus episodes. So today, we're here to show you guys a tip and trick for the fall, winter time, and early spring time. It's a little cold outside. Yep. The water is getting cold now. The water will be cold in the winter, and then the water will stay cold in the spring, even if it's a little bit warm. So today, it is fall. It's almost the first day of November. It's actually Halloween. How's yep. Halloween play? You mean it? Yeah, I mean it. I mean it. I mean it. I mean it. But, um, you know, today's like what? 65, 70s? But yeah. the water's a little frigid. So when we go to Leader of Shark today, or if you guys are surf fishing, you may not want to get wet. And there are all kinds of waders on the market today. We're here to tell you guys about the best ones we have found this far, and that is high seas waders. All right, guys, before we get into the walkthrough with these waders, don't forget to check out the description. The promo code is right there. Click on that, go order you a pair. They're super comfortable, they'll be super warm, they'll be super dry. Don't nope. miss out. November 16th, that's when it ends, so you better get on it. So, jump in, man. What yep. we got? All right, so these are the neoprene hunting waders, actually. I got these specifically for, so I don't have to continuously hop in, hop out of my waders whenever I want to yak and bait or whatnot. They'll keep you, keep you real warm. You say warm. Very warm. Like, I was kayaking earlier. It's like 65. Hot. Still sweating. Yeah, it's Still hot. sweating. So, got the little pocket here for your phone whatnot. My favorite part has got to be the hand warmers right there. If you're getting them for hunting, you got your shell holders. Yeah. There's a another pocket right there on the inside, inside for the Whatever you else you want to put in there. My shoulder pads fell off. <laughs> Real thick straps so they don't dig when you're wearing other other clothing underneath. The rubber boots, not the yeah, not the knee free socks. So yeah. So basically, mine. So Blaine's on the side of like he wants to like when it's winter time. That's basically what the waiter's for. It's winter time, but we can use them in the, in the fall and spring. Blaine's approach is get comfortable neoprene warm waders that you can wear continuously throughout the day so when a shark gets on he's already ready to go my approach is to get in and out i prefer wearing like car hard coveralls and then a big hunting coat and then wearing big like boots higher boots and then changing in and out um you know when i get a shark on i'm gonna get out of my warm stuff jump into these fly fishing waders or jump into it when i'm gonna go lead or somebody's fish um, it's just a really a preference thing. Neither one is wrong. On mine here, I do have the fly fishing waders. Again, you can find the link in the description to get the discount up until November 16th. So, but I love these things. They're absolutely great. There's a pocket up front here. That's where my wading belt's at. So I'll put my wading belt on. Always good if you're gonna be getting in the water. Oh, don't, don't put it on like you got loops for a reason. No, I put it like this. I can't, the lazy man style. There is loops, there is loops, but sometimes I like moving it up and down. Mine also comes with a hand warmer, so it's a little bit, uh, toned down from Blaine's, it's not quite as well, but it is nice. They do have hand warmers right inside here. You've got some loops and stuff like that for various items if you do use them for fishing, but we just use them for catching and leadering sharks and basically staying dry. Uh, mine has an inside pocket as well, and then it's just this really thin PVC almost type of material. Yeah. Um, they're real nice. They have the neoprene booties like I showed you earlier, and um, they're just light. They're just light, they slide in, slide off, and um, I really, I really enjoy them. So. There's a lot of good options out there for waders when you guys are looking. The reason I would say to go with high seas over other brands is obviously the construction material is good. They have a great customer service, very active people who we work with and we've worked with in the past. So if you have any issues with the waders, you're going to get somebody in the States who's going to answer your phone calls and take care of your claims if you have any issues. And then there's a life time warranty that's probably the biggest deal yep. right so it's a lifetime warranty so it's not a limited lifetime warranty it's a lifetime warranty so you buy these things they're a great investment for a long time to come but neoprene waders fly fishing waders kirsten has some blue waders and i'll show you guys in a little while on the cheaper side so if you guys aren't wanting to go in the hundred dollar range like these are you can find some in the 60 80 dollar range there too so that's going to be it for today's bonus episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you guys got something out of it. Don't forget the promo code below, but give this video a thumbs up, drop a comment below, share it with your friends, and as always, we'll catch you guys next week for more bonus videos, but Monday and Friday for the regular scheduled full episodes. Yoo!